In just the last hour, Minneapolis Mayor Jacob Fry said he will release the body cam video of the shooting death of Thurman Blevins. He says that will happen after Blevins' family is consulted and after the BCA has interviewed key witnesses. Today, the BCA identified the officers involved as Officer Ryan Kelly, who joined the department in 2013, and Officer Justin Schmidt, who started with Minneapolis Police in 2014. Police shot and killed Blevins early Saturday evening after chasing him for several blocks. The BCA says that the 31-year-old was carrying a gun when he ran. The autopsy shows that he was shot multiple times. WCCO's Jennifer Merrily is at Minneapolis City Hall tonight where she joins us now. So, Jen, what can you tell us? Well, Amelia, Mayor Jacob Fry made the announcement that he'll release that body camera video late tonight. It is a rare move, but he says he has the authority to release it, and he wants this process to be transparent. But he says it's important that those interviews happen first to make sure that they retain the integrity of this investigation. Here's also what we learned today about the officers involved. The police shooting death of Thurman Blevins has evoked emotion throughout the community with signs of grief near where it happened in North Minneapolis on Saturday. The community has called for transparency in the investigation, including releasing body camera video as soon as legally possible. We are asking people to remain vigilant in terms of advocating for a release of all public data and information surrounding the death of Thurman Blevins, and we are asking for police accountability in this situation. Community advocates hope the video will shed light on what happened when Minneapolis police officers Ryan Kelly and Justin Schmidt, according to the BCA, pursued an armed Blevins and later fired their weapons. Minneapolis police records show Officer Ryan Kelly had five complaints against him that were closed with no discipline since joining the department in 2013. Officer Justin Schmidt started with the department a year later in 2014. Two complaints have been closed with no discipline. One remains open. Schmidt joined the military after 9-11 and was deployed several times during Operation Iraqi Freedom and Operation Enduring Freedom. According to Archway Defense, a private protection training company Schmidt contracts with, he sought firearms and use of force classes to law enforcement and civilians since 2007. And we do expect a crowd here at City Hall tomorrow for a city council com committee meeting. Uh, city leaders or community leaders have pushed for people to come here to demand answers about this officer involved shooting. We don't know what, if anything, will change now that Mayor Fry has said that he'll release that body camera video sooner than expected. If that will change this group's push for transparency. Amelia? All right. Thank you, Jennifer.